Here's the coffee shop. It's a beautiful day. It's Christmas morning. Merry Christmas. And I came outside and this is what the buckets of ice, buckets of water look like when I came outside. So that's the kind of cold that we had. Wow. So I like to put the ice there and just just watch it do its thing. It'll start melting. And that'll be a be an okay thing. Well that's what I'm doing, watching that watching ice melt. I'm Hello Rodney, thanks for watching and bye bye. Hey I'm Hello Rodney, thanks for clicking on my video. Well I'm gonna do something very, very special today. And it involves that. Be careful. This thing right here is sharp. This is sharp enough to cut tomatoes. But I'm going to show you how to open up a coconut. Theoretically. I hope I don't kill myself. And also, if you're doing something like this, be careful because this blade is really sharp. And you're going to, I'm going to be whacking, so I'm going to be very conscious of the fact that this blade is uh, very sharp. As a matter of fact, I'm going to kind of dull it a little bit by putting on some tape on this blade. Because this thing is sharp enough, literally sharp enough, to cut tomatoes. I have cut tomatoes with this blade because it is that sharp. So I'm going to put some tape on this just in case I get too nuts with this coconut thing. Because I've never done this before, but I saw a video, so I'll do it just for fun. Okay, now coconut. You got your coconut. You got your coconut with these three dots things right here, and then this is, I guess that's the stem where it comes out. Now there's a, there is a, around the coconut, there is a, like an equator that goes around this thing. And that's the weakest part of the coconut. So we're going to start whacking it, okay? Hear that? We're going to start whacking this thing. Hear how hard it is. There you go, it cracked. Okay, I've got a bowl over here. I'm going to be needing this bowl because I'm going to collect the milk, but you can see it cracked right there. See it cracked and it's got, it's got uh, the water coming out of it right there. Here we go. Okay, so it cracked. So that's good. So you can see that the, the water is dripping out of it. So we keep whacking it. We keep whacking it. Yeah, I'm getting water splashing on me and stuff, but you can see that it's coming out. There we go. Okay. So we got all this beautiful water that just came out of the coconut. That's a big success. Nobody got cut, and we still have the, it's still intact, so we got to keep whacking it till we, uh, till we go all the way through the whackage, because it's got a crit, it's got some, got some more whackage we got to do right there. There we go. Now there is the coconut. There it is. Ta-da! Now, uh, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to take the, take this back into the, to the kitchen area, because this is going to be, this is going to be the Hello Rodney kitchen channel, it's, I'm at the coconut, coconut whacking channel, so it's going to be non-stop coconut whacking season here, what was I going to get, oh yeah. I got to get a spoon of some sort. This one right here will probably work. It's got kind of a curve to it. I don't know. I don't know if it's going to work or not. We'll, we'll see if it's going to work. And we got that one. This one might be a little better, but I'm not sure. We'll take them both just for fun. 
We'll take them both just for fun. It's the Coconut Whackin' Channel. Yeah, hello, Rodney. Mr. Coconut Whacker. You're a coconut whacker from East Neck Bucker. Oh, what a wonderful time. So we get this, and we put this in there, and we start trying to pry it out. Man, that is, that is tight. So let's see here. Okay, there's made a little bit of an inroad in there. So what we're trying to do is uh, just go in there a little bit and start to try to, you know, just take the meat of this thing and start pushing it away from the, the shell. It's the Coconut Whackin' Channel, yeah! Coconut Whackin' Channel on YouTube. I think with a channel like this, I could probably get like a million subscribers. So everybody, you know, I'm going to change the name of my channel from Hello Rodney to Hello Rodney's Coconut Channel. Let's see if we can get this thing out of there. Okay. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to get it out all in one piece, but there we go. So there we go. So that's how you do it. And then you've got this right here, which you can use as a, a dog dish. So this one has got... The other one was a little bit... This is more than half. So anyway, I just wanted to uh, uh, show you how to do that. Because I saw a video. I had this coconut. And I thought what I was going to do was just get a hammer and whack it and drain the stuff out. And then just keep pounding it till it totally succumbed. But... Uh, Anyway, mm. first coconut, pretty good. So I've got coconut now, and I will be munching on that. It's just fun to have that coconut around. Now, one thing I do remember as a kid, eating coconut out of the bag, you know. Coconut with a crisp apple and, like, Longhorn cheese, that, you know, big cheese that they use for tacos and stuff. And it was great. So anyway, I just wanted to do that. I'm Hello Rodney. Thanks for watching. And bye-bye. Well, I went back <coughs> to do the other half, and it's not going well. So, you don't come to this channel for that kind of stuff. You come for something exciting. Exciting and new. <coughs> Man, I got some coconut caught in my throat. Do you care? No, you could care less. So, it's difficult to get that out. So, what do you do? Bring out the animal. Take the coconut, put the coconut in the bag. Put the coconut on the anvil. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Now that was really something special. Ah. Ah. So now the coconut has been released from its whatever it is. And it will be easier to, to 
take apart. Look at that, how delicate. What a delicate technique. Oh, look at that, it's marvelous. Oh, that fell over. Ooh. So, anyway, it came apart. And so, I may need to continue with the whacking process, but for now, I'm just having some coconut. Excuse me for doing it like this. I don't think this is very sophisticated, very wonderful, but now ah, what are you going to do? I'm Ella Rodney. Thanks for watching, and uh, well, <clears throat> the ice fell over. I had it stacked up, at least a couple of pieces, anyway. All right. I'm Ella Rodney. Thanks for watching, and bye bye.